Tonight, the tragedy at Tempe Town Lake. We have just learned the names of the family killed. Police telling us that Danica, Glenn, Edward, and Baxter, their three small children, died after their SUV they were in crashed right into the lake. Angie Cayley live at the scene with how witnesses described what happened in this heartbreaking situation. Angie. Well, Kim, you know, we were really hoping that two-year-old was going to pull through. He was in critical condition for a short time, but as you know, he has passed. It's just really hard to make sense of this because where we are, cars normally aren't even around here. You can see where our truck is up there. That is actually a construction site, and the road is about 100 yards from there. So this SUV would have had to have come through that construction site or at least uh, the road by the uh, apartment there down over this little bank across the sidewalk and you can see it appears to be tire marks left behind before that SUV plunged into the water. Horrible and heartbreaking. That's how a police spokesperson describes this scene. A child's car seat sitting on that submerged SUV in Tempe Town Lake. They worked on one guy for what seemed like 20 minutes. Lexi Mills lives nearby. Just after midnight, she watched police and a nearby fisherman try to save the victims. They pulled out two adults and two children and performed CPR, then took them to the hospital. Hours later, when police identified the woman, they learned another child may have been inside. A dive team pulled out the third child who died on scene. That three-year-old boy was strapped in a car seat in the back. These are three little kids, completely innocent, had no way to save themselves. Lieutenant Mike Pooley from Tempe Police clearly shaken by the tragedy. He says the family is from Phoenix and they don't yet know what they were doing in Tempe last night or why their vehicle ended up in the lake. It's just, it's just a horrible scene. You know, it's just heartbreaking. Now, it still smells like gasoline out here where that SUV was pulled out. You can see the debris on the ground from that SUV. Those kids, want to name them here, three-year-old Rain, two-year-old Nazaya, and one-year-old Zariah. Again, no clue why this happened. That is something that is still under investigation. Kim, back to you. Angie, so sad. Thank you.